Okay, sure. Hi, how are you? I'm good. Awesome. What is your name? Tina Anya. Tina yeah. Anya. What, yes. what program are you with? Um, I'm actually working with um, one of the government hospitals over in Abuja. Awesome. What is the name of the hospital? It's called NMSL Hospital Abuja. Yes, it's awesome. affiliated with the um, Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation. Excellent. Yeah. And what is your role there? I'm the cardiologist there. Awesome. Yeah. So you came to um, Lagos to partner with the Healthy Heart Foundation and do education and training here. Yes. So can you tell me a little bit about your experience? Oh, it's been awesome, really. Most of it is new to me because um, for the past um, 12 years, I've practiced as a clinical cardiologist, but in a center where um, cardiothoracic surgery is like non-existent. So we just dabbled into uh, cardiac surgery sometime uh, last year. That was before I joined my current, the current uh, hospital where I work. And unfortunately, I was too busy with clinic patients to be able to participate in the program. So this is like my first encounter with uh, perioperative care of mm -hmm. cardiac patients. And I've learned, I've learned so much. You know, it's one thing when you read it, uh, you read about it, and it's another thing when you're there and you're part of the experience. It's, it's been awesome. Excellent. So you're training under the Boom Sweden team? Yes. Yes. And Dr. Shahab? Yes. Yes. So um, tell me about your experience. Have you gone into surgery and what's that been like? Oh, no. I didn't go into theater with them. I, okay. I really don't have any place there. I've been okay. in the ICU. Okay. Uh, and then, okay, we see the patients in the ward before okay. they go okay. in for the surgery. And then when they come out, I'm in the ICU with the team that receives them. Okay. Yes. Excellent. So um, one particular experience, you know, really impacted me, and that's the a patient who was operated um, yesterday. He had a, a mitral valve replacement and a tricuspid valve repair. And when he came out, I mean, he was stable, and within a short while, post-op, I mean, his his vitals started dipping, mm -hmm. and um, the anesthesiologist came out and saw him and he immediately knew that he was accumulating um, blood in the pericardial space. Wow. And that was because his drain had blocked. Mm -hmm. So he tried, you know, milking out the thrombus from the, um, the drain. And he, you know, the technique he was using, it was, I, I was so, I was so, it was interesting, it was exciting to see that you know, such could be done without having to open the patient up again. And within a matter of a few minutes, the drain was working and the patient's vital stabilized. Oh, I mean, that's something you just have to be present to see. It's not something someone can describe to you, how the patient improved after his intervention. And I'm glad I was here to be a part of that. Excellent. Well, thank you. We hope you come back and join Boom again. I do look forward to it. Right. Excellent. <laughs>